Hello everyone, so today I'm going to talk about a perfume that I just recently got. Specifically, I wanted to bring this during my vacation and also working because this is the travel version of this perfume. I first smelled this in um, London when we were there, when I was there having vacation and because it was so popular, I really got curious of this because Demi Rowling was um, raving about it so I, I when I was able to find a tester because there's a specific store here where I will usually buy my perfumes from um, sells this brand but they did they don't have the poets of Berlin so which is really strange but when I was able to smell it finally in person I fell in love with it immediately but I didn't buy it in London uh, right away I waited and I just decided if I I need it someday I will get it but in travel version so so I think I will show you the unboxing of this first they really packed it really um, uh, beautifully everything is well protected um yeah i did i loved the experience while opening it um from the small details from the stickers from everything the box is really like a yeah um a bright yellow box that yeah it's just it i felt the luck the luxury experience with this uh while unboxing it and um then with Delina, Delina was just a basic, it, it was even a small box and it didn't, I didn't felt like how I felt while I was unboxing the, this um, specific package that I got from this brand. So, oh, oh I forgot to mention, it's from the Wilhelm, Wilhelm Parfumerie New York, but I think it's from a French uh, company but probably uh, they got inspired uh, while making this in New York first so this is the box you saw that while I'm unboxing it I'll just open it because I I need to change look even this it's really it's like I'm this is even well packed than Hermes um, so I think I got the samples which is great it's really even this i love the packaging and and you know they protect it really well with all the papers amazing so this is where the main uh this is how the bottle looks like so as you see i finished the whole like um bottle of this and what i love about this is glass and as you see there's like their um i think that's their logo from this brand it's like I think almost like a water lily something and the cup is magnetic oh you see that I'm so happy with this and um, yeah it's it doesn't take so much space so this is the perfect like traveling perfume for me it's a bit longer but and heavier but this is better than i did buy the travel version of my uh, winter my favorite winter um perfume from killian but it's too heavy it's too bulky i didn't love it this is the perfect travel case for me and i'm glad that this is how it looks so as you see i used this already and so i need i will show you how to refill it so i think i just need to slide this first because i i didn't see anyone reviewing this so i was thinking before buying how will i refill it and also while like opening it it was like a disaster <laughs> because i did a mistake um so normally it should look like this so three of the bottles are here like that and i think oh they even have a card Oh, okay so and the cup was here if you saw I think my unboxing and three bottles like that so remember when you need you, you you will use it so every bottle of this wait I think this is 10, 10 ml each there's another cup that's closing it so you need to remove it because my first attempt I for I didn't remove it and it was stuck with this cap because there's a magnet inside and it was hard to remove it so remember to remove that so and I think I'm just gonna put it back 
to the old one. I hope they have recycling thing. I'm not sure if they do that, but I will try to ask where I bought. No, I bought this online, so I'm not sure. If and then it just goes like that. And you're ready for a new one. I really love this system. I hope more more of the brands, like you know, the niche brands, do this because it's really handy, and I prefer. It. And on my bag, it's safety. It will not look. It will just. It will take so much effort to open it. So it's safety. I like the one I bought from Kilian. It's really bad. I'm so regretting buying that um, travel version, but yeah. So I'll just put this back because I I don't need it for now. Also, their box is like with engraving, you know. I, I know there's like um, a cute detail with even box. It feels really expensive, like heavy. Everything, all the details of this brand is amazing. Uh, for sure, uh, if I would love another scent, I think I'm gonna buy more. Wait for the the other. Oh, they also give me the small version of the Poets of Berlin, which is good because if you don't like it, change your mind. You can return it because you didn't open this yet. So the other one I have is 125 Bloom. And wait, I can't see this. Uh, and darling Nikki, I f I remember I did not like both of them. Wait, I'll try to sniff them again. But mm. oh oh no, the uh, darling Nikki is almost like a shampoo smell that the when it dries out it's almost like has like a plastic toy smell for it to it. No, I don't like this. So I remember I did not like this. Both of them. Oh no, no, not my thing. Oh, now I notice it. So every letter it corresponds also like Darling Nikki. This, no. I thought it was just a sign. Wow, that's really a cute detail. Oh, and this also Bloom 125th. What is this? One, 125th and Bloom. It's also written here, like that. Wait. It's getting brighter. Okay. Oh, <laughs> it went to my nose. Okay, I'll let this dry down first, but I also don't like this. So, even like the cup of their. <laughs> um, Sample is like yellow, packaging, experience, amazing brand. And I ordered this online and it went, I think it took a bit like three days or four days, something like that, is, which is really good. Probably less, but it was a long time ago. I forgot it already. So I love the, when you order, wait, when you order online from them, you will not regret it. So, so I did, right. Oh, this is almost like animalic, like, like carpet smell that I don't understand. No, not for me. I think that's more for like men scent. I feel like men will love this. So uh, for the description, they said Berlin, a city that is alive with the same kinetic magnetic energy that attracted David Bowie for a few from formative, recuperative, and prolific years in the 70s, perpetual creative movement embodied in a bold collision of blueberry, lemon, bamboo, green, wild oris, and Haitian vetiver. So the top note is blueberry and lemon, which is strange. I don't smell that. Wait, I need to... But I, I think um, I do smell, especially the dry down, like, uh, some whiffs of it throughout the day. I s do smell fruity. Blueberry lemon, heart notes vanilla green wild oris, and base notes is vanilla, sandalwood, and vetiver. So I'm normally I love vanilla and perfume. So when I smelled it, I did love this. So oh yeah, now I smell like the lemony, more lemony than blueberry, but it can be a bit. 
it can feel almost like smells sour because I think of the lemon and blueberry but uh, with the vanilla and I think woody scents um, I love the combination I feel like this is more unisex or more probably men would love this more than women because of how woody and yeah sour almost kind of scent but I love it I I will not buy it if I didn't love it but and I also bought this because of my trip to Barcelona I know this is almost like because of the lemon blueberry and when I smelled it I remembered it when I was in London it's more like summerish scent for me but I did try to wear it also before like almost autumn time almost like getting cold here but i still feel like it's not that strong it will not like offend anyone but this is the scent that i noticed um i didn't really hear anyone saying that i smell good normally especially some of my colleagues are really you know um you, they really compliment me if they smell me but this i don't think i heard someone say saying that i smelled good so probably because uh, it, it's not it's there's no wall for them but for me important for me that i love how i smell and i um yeah that i love the scent even though no one is really appreciating it but i feel like the longevity is also good not probably as long lasting as the other niche that i tried you need to um reapply this every probably every three hours or when you go out but um, normally I, I never do that but sometimes if I feel like I don't smell my perfume anymore no matter what brand it is I try to re reapply it if I have it with me so this is I think if you don't like sour sour almost like soury or like sour kind of scent I think you will not like it but if you like woody a bit of fresh kind of scent like i feel like the combination of woody vanilla and like sour kind of smell they if you combine them together that's how this should smell but i do love it but i pref I, I guess the more women would not like this probably i'm not sure but yeah i think probably in summertime like when it's really warm outside it's this too heavy like too too much kind of scent it's not like you know like a fresh scent that you would prefer during winter time but yeah um i know during summertime but yeah it still works as like almost ending summer i think they should work uh, better and yeah all throughout autumn winter time it could be still I think I can still um, wear this winter time. I, I I would wear this again because um, I forgot it. I just put it in a drawer, but I I knew I did love the scent and yeah the oh the as you see the the fluid of this is a bit dark. So I thought it would be too strong, but it's not. It's not really strong. Well for me, I love this kind of scent, and yeah I I just. I, because of my experience ordering from them you know how they packed it and everything i think i would try more i did smell the mango skin that's also popular and did not like it i don't like to smell like mango it's really like mango but like almost like very artificial and strong kind of scent so i i did i did not like it at all I, maybe uh, some people really love that kind of scent but for me i can't i will i don't want to smell like that so and also one of the popular i think uh something with a hotel something i did not like that um what else morning chest i did not know this is the only um I think scent I did like I I tried almost like I tested almost and this is the only one I did appreciate probably if they will release something in the future and I will like it I might I will surely buy from them again but so far this is the best uh, smelling perfume I've tried from them for my taste so I just realized in case you're wondering how it's sprayed or if it's fine or not this is how it looks like yeah i think the mist is really i don't know how you call it but it's really sprays you know like not 
too much but it's just like a nice like fine mist so. and um i think you will not you this i think it took me probably two months to finish it and i wear this almost every day i think so it will last long and this cost the travel version is the travel version of this is 135 which is really not bad and because i get i you get the 30 ml so with the bottles i didn't like the bottle because it's like an awkward shape it's like a circle um i will show you a picture here so you'll see and i felt like if i store it it will be a bit it will take so much space because it's really like a a bit um big circle kind of packaging and i didn't want that so oh wait so i just opted for the travel version and i can also carry it around because i notice sometimes i want to you know uh, reapply my perfume and i don't have it because it's too heavy for me so i just see now like the 100 ml or ml is like 250 and the 50 ml is um 150 so you will save more with um you get more with the bottle than the travel size but no i i prefer this uh compact ones so yeah i hope this video was helpful for you oh before i forget to sleep people ask about, about my lipstick so i did first try or first apply i thought this would be enough the party kiss liquid lip color from mac in the shade mull it over but it was too like light orange so i added on top the marrakesh mirror to make it a bit darker not too orange so that's my lipstick today and for my blush is the tarte uh, blush in the shade seduce so yeah i hope this video was helpful for you if you have any questions please do let me know and i will try to get back to you as soon as i can if you find this video helpful please give this a thumbs up it will help my channel a lot and if you could consider subscribing to my channel it will mean so much to me so yeah thank you for watching and hope i see you in my next one bye